Hi, I'm Mike Katowski with Showcase Construction. In past videos, we've taken a look at homes and, and the way the systems are built. We've looked at the insulation, we looked at the exterior siding, we looked at all the components to go together to make a home function. Today we're coming out to a home we just recently finished. The HVAC contractor is here, Jerry Hall with Total Systems. He's going to take us through the system and show us exactly how it works with the, with the insulating that we put in the home, the foam insulation we put in the home, the tight seal that we have there. Um, this home is completely sealed, sealed crawl space, sealed attic space. Let's see if we can find Jerry. Jerry. Mike, how you doing? I'm doing well. How are you? Fine. Good to see you. Thanks for meeting us today. Sure, not a problem at all. appreciate it. I know you're out here fine-tuning the system. Yes, sir. Um, getting everything in working order, and we want to just take some of your time today, if, uh, fine. if you would. Show us around. Um, explain to us what an HVA system actually is. Um, actually is? Okay. There's a lot of myths out there as yes, far sir. as what it does, mm -hmm. how big it should be, where the air comes from. And we always see the, the final product, and we, we see these things sitting outside that spin and twirl and start right. up and blow air, and uh, we see the big boxes, and then we know we got air filters that we have to change. But yes, sir. we really like to, to learn and understand how this works and how this integrates into the system mm -hmm. that Showcase has put together with our insulating packages. Okay. So All right. Good. You want to start at the outdoor unit? Sure. Okay. Best place to start. Great. Well, Mike, of course, what we have out here is... Uh, a condensing unit which contains your compressor and the main refrigeration cycle. As you uh -huh. stated, there's uh, package units of several different styles, but this particular one here is a 16 sear unit. Uh, and of course, a sear rating is actually seasonal energy efficiency ratio. You compare it to gas mileage on your car. Right. The higher the sear rating, the more miles per gallon you'll get out of this unit or the less kilowatts it will use power-wise to produce a BTU. So the less energy it takes to actually cool the home. Exactly, to cool or heat the home. We're in the crawl space now, and this is a sealed crawl space, which is a different from most conventional crawl spaces you're going to see. In here, we don't have any fiberglass floor insulation that you're probably accustomed to seeing. One of the first things you'll notice about our sealed crawl space system that we do is how clean it is underneath the home. Typically, when you come underneath a home, it's going to be very moist, very damp. You're going to be fighting the cobwebs and the spiders and walking across the dirt on the ground. Here, we don't have that problem. Here, we've completely covered everything in the plastic. We've ran the plastic up the walls, up the piers, and then we've covered it in spray foam. And this on in this particular wall here is a closed cell spray foam, which we run from the bottom to the very top always leaving a termite strip up at the top, and that's part of our code. We also come in and insulate the rim board across the top here, so that we have formed a complete seal from the bottom of the foundation all the way up into the roof, across the roof decking. The whole house envelope contains everything that's in the home. The entire HVAC system is inside of that envelope. Even if we were to have leaky duct, that leaky duct would be leaking into conditioned space. On a conventional system, a home that has a crawl space with vents, if this duct were leaking, it would be leaking into unconditioned space. Same thing goes in the attic.